Welcome! In this video, we'll explain what field conditionals are and what they mean for your process in PipeFi. Let's get started! Conditionals are a set of rules you can create to show or hide fields in your pipe's forms and phases. They can make your process more dynamic and help standardize the information you collect or fill out in fields, asking for additional information only when it's needed. For you to better understand how this logic works, let's take a look at a marketing request process just as an example. In this pipe, whenever a manager is assigned to approve requests, they must inform whether the marketing materials are approved or not. By selecting yes, no other field will appear in this phase. However, if they select no, a conditional field appears asking for additional information about this approval. This is just one example of the many ways you can utilize conditional fields in your process. Let's add a conditional field to this pipe start form so you can learn the basics. Begin by accessing the conditional fields options. You can do so by opening the forms page and clicking on edit form. There you can access all conditional fields created for this form or face and delete or add new ones. Keep in mind that before adding a conditional to a field, you must have created the field in your pipe first. First things first, write a title for this field conditional so you can easily find it later in your pipe. In this example, let's imagine your stakeholders must select a request type from a list of options. In a drop-down list, if a person selects the option Other, another field will appear and ask for additional information, such as a text field for them to describe what other request type it is. If this happens, it means it's true, so the conditional field will appear. If it doesn't happen, it means it's false and that it triggers an opposite action, which is the text field remains hidden. To save time, you can click on the autofill suggestion button and PipeFi will automatically fill out the exact opposite action for you. Then we can save it and see the magic happen. Remember that to create a conditional field, you must have the admin role in your pipe. Now that you know what conditional fields are, it's time to get hands on. If you need an extra help with building your workflow in PipeFi, you can click on the question mark icon and click on Help Center to access articles, tutorials, and more. You can also talk to other individuals that use PipeFi and exchange ideas with our community. See you next time!